What is going on everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm back at you with some plain mechanic simulator. Uh, basically the, um, let me see here, the old work order says, uh, a student crashed the plane on his first solo flight. <laughs> oh man. Uh, a new aircraft has just arrived, but it spent a lot of time just standing outside, so it's in really bad shape. Make sure that everything works and as it sh or yeah, it, blah, 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 sorry, can't speak English right now. Make sure everything works as it should before we send it to the paint shop. So, uh, they basically just want us to take a look at some stuff, I guess. I don't even know what we're really supposed to do, but uh, I kind of cheated a little bit before I started recording and found that these are bad down here. The wheel is bad. And... The uh, fuel filter over here is bad as well. So I don't know if that's all that's going to be bad. I don't really know. We'll just replace what I know is bad for now and we'll start there. And if the objective isn't complete after that, then we'll have to tear it down some more, I guess. So that's what we're going to get started with today. So let's get started with this fuel filter. Why not? Let's go ahead and pull this guy off. Bam, there it is piece of cake all right and then to do the wheel thing we gotta freaking we gotta get the jack over here and jack it up man so let me get the jack over here this is always a pain in the ass too man there we go let's crank this baby up a little bit come on All right, the wheels are off the ground. Should be good to go with that. Let's take a look at the subject here. It says we had bad wheel on this side. And these compression legs are bad as well. So we're going to be taking those off. So these over here. Oh, there's one more bolt. Alright, then we'll go down here to the other side. I know this one is bad as well. If it'll let me do it. There we go. Let's go ahead and pull that one off. I said this wheel was okay. Pretty sure. Yeah. I don't know about the wheel cap, but yeah, it's fine. Alright. Uh, so I think that's about it for that. Now we just need to go to the workbench or whatever and see if we can't repair anything. Maybe I can try not to screw that up this time. Fuel filter is damaged and it looks like we can repair it. So I'm going to try it again here. So let's give it a shot. Maybe we can save it. Maybe not. I don't know. But we're going to try it. Kind of got the hang of how it's supposed to work. If we can do this one, we can probably save it. Oh yeah! Oh, there's one more. Dang it! Oh, that's gonna—that's a tight one there. Oh, I got it. Part fully restored. Hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's go over here to the uh, parts truck, and we'll go ahead and check all this stuff off. This is what we need to get. Sign that motherfucker right there. And then we'll uh, crouch back down here and reassemble this baby. Hopefully this is all that's wrong with it because that would be pretty fast and easy if it was. Dang it, I should have put this thing on first. Alright, let's screw this baby back on. We gotta make sure we screw all the bolts in all the way this time because last time I freaking failed it somehow by doing that. It's kind of dumb. Alright, let's put this one on. There we go. And then if we look up here, we got this fuel filter. Let's go ahead and put the new one on. 
Alright. So, we're apparently missing something because the uh, objective is not that inspect the whole aircraft it says so I don't know I don't know if they're wanting me to like tear the entire engine down that is a possibility because um, I don't think there's anything else or anything else on the outside that I can fix that is bad I'm pretty sure I checked the tail skid down there it's fine so it's not that so it must be the freaking engine uh, well, let's go ahead and just fill this baby up. We need to put fuel in it, and they want us to top the oil off. Let's go ahead and knock that out. Get those out of the way. But yeah, I'm a little confused. I have a feeling I'm going to be tearing the engine apart. So... Yeah. Would you just... Jeez. Can I seriously not reach that? Like, like what the heck? Oh, uh, now I'm getting stuck on the ladder. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. What do I do? I can't jump in this damn game. Oh, thank God. Thought I was a goner, man. All right, let's try that again. There we go. We'll take that off. And we'll grab the hose. Would you just climb the ladder? There we go. Alright. Let's put the hose in the hole. And then we'll uh, fill her up, man. Oh, damn. She was empty. Okay. Okay. We'll go ahead and uh, put this away. Can I put the cap back on right now? No. Oh, fuel cap? Yes. Yay! Alright. Put that back. This guy will get out of the way. And then we'll move this over here. Freaking ladders in the way, kind of. Let me move this ladder out of the way. There we go. Uh, grab it. Come on. Okay. Uh, the oil tank is right here. Okay, and then we'll grab the freaking hose over here. All right, let's go ahead and fill her up. Pump that oil in there. Go, 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 go. Try not to overfill it because I know you get docked for overfilling it. So we'll try to fill it up. Oh, geez. All right. Yeah, that's good. Perfect. All right. Let's put this hose back. Put the little oil caddy back, and then we'll put the oil cap on before we forget that. There we go. Now, as far as I know, yeah, we're still not done. So there's something else we're missing. It's probably something to do with the... Uh, it's probably something inside the engine that is jacked up or something. Who knows? 
So I don't know yet. I guess I'll be tearing it down. Let me get this thing out of here. Whoa! Alright, there we go. So yeah, there must be something else going on in here because I inspected everything on the outside of the engine that I could see. And everything is in the fine condition. So that must mean there's something inside the rocker boxes or we got a bad piston or something going on. So we're going to just, uh, I don't know what else to do except take a look at some other stuff because as far as I know everything on the outside of the aircraft is fixed. I don't think I can, I can't really check anything else that I know of. Pristine, yeah, I mean I don't. I already kind of looked around a little bit and tried to see what I could see. Um, but I mean, mostly everything looks like it's in pretty good shape. and valves are bad who knows push rods are fine aha there's the one uh, now I just gotta change the damn camera view because I can't see what the hell's going on uh, let's see here oops the sun is blinding me. Alright, let's continue inspecting this stuff. Maybe that's the last part I'll have to change. That'd be sweet. Maybe I won't have to dig down any further. So we know that's bad. Let's go ahead and... Uh... Wait, what is it telling me? Yeah, I was going to say, you better freaking work. Come on, man. All right, and then we'll take that to the workbench and see if we can't repair that. Nope. So we just got to go get a new one at the parts truck. That's too bad. I was looking forward to uh, practicing my repairing skills some more. Dang it. Alright, let's get this baby back up in here and see if that's uh, the last part. I hope so. I don't want to have to tear this whole thing down. No, I pushed the wrong button. Alright, let's put this baby back in. See what we get. Nope. So there's still something else missing, man. There's something else going on. So, I'm just going to go ahead and start tearing this baby down, I guess. That's all I can do. So, I'll see you guys here in a little bit. Once I tear it down, I'll let you know what I find.
All right, so as of right now, I found bad head gaskets. Um, so I think we should dig down a little bit further, probably. And uh, just inspect the pistons and make sure they're all right. So we'll see how that goes. Come on, head gasket, there you go. Ah, I clicked the wrong thing. Um, but yeah, hopefully that's, that's about it and there's not too much more we can just reassemble it and be done with this one. Uh, let's go ahead and inspect the rings and pistons on this baby real quick. Damaged. Fine. Fine. Piston rod. So maybe it's got a bad head gasket and a couple rings or something. Maybe that'll be it, and we'll get lucky. Uh, let me see if I can't see this rod. There we go. Okay, the rods are good. All right, so we know we got what is it, one bad ring and a head gasket. So let's go ahead and pull that one ring out. There we go. I don't hope we don't have to tear the rest of this thing apart. Uh, that would suck if I do, because I plan on trying to put it back together after this. I don't know why I'm coming over here. There's nothing to repair, so I just need to. Uh, get those parts I need right now head gasket and a piston ring there we go oh whoops no all right let's get down here where we can see it I can't even see the rings there we go all right let's put these rings in okay Put the barrels back on. New head gasket. Pristine. There we go. Yeah, so we should be able to get this baby rolling now, hopefully. But it didn't tell me that all the parts were found. So it's kind of scaring me. I wonder if there's something underneath the crank in there that's not quite right. Yeah, because usually it says, you know, all primary objectives complete. And then you just have to reassemble it. Uh, so I'm getting worried I'm going to have to tear it even further down, man. Alright, so I kind of freaking figured it out because I'm a dumbass. I had everything completed. All I had to do was freaking put the heads back on it and it said it was complete. So that's totally my fault. God. But whatever. It's going back together now. It said all the primary objectives were complete. So let's just reassemble this baby. And uh, we'll go ahead and sign off on this job here. But man, hopefully uh, we don't have to inspect the whole aircraft next time, jeez. But now I kind of know what I need to do if something like this comes up again. I mean, this, there's not too much to this plane. Um, I know it, the game kind of goes a little more in depth later on with like some of the radio boxes and stuff like that, but 
I'm not 100% sure on that stuff yet, so we'll just find out together as we play along in Play Mechanic Simulator. I mean, by golly, I'll be a Play Mechanic after this. <laughs> no, not really. But, maybe, I don't know. Alright, there's the plugs. Hopefully this goes pretty quick, because I would like to finish this. Let's put these babies on. Don't want to forget those. Drop this cover in. Yeah, we'll get this baby back together in no time here. couple more minutes hopefully yeah I'm still trying to get the hang of this game a little bit it's so much different than the car mechanic simulator in certain ways that it's just like kind of weird so I put a lot of hours in on car mechanic simulator but not that many on this uh, particular game here so Get over here to these other uh, spark plugs real quick. Yeah, I can't believe all I had to do was put the damn heads back on and it said it was complete, but it was probably because of the stupid head gasket crap, but whatever. I kind of had a feeling, I was like, maybe I just need to reassemble it some more and then... I put the heads on it, and it said it was complete, so I was like, all right, whatever. <laughs> Let's finish this crap. But we have almost got it now. Let's put this uh, front plate back on. We'll get the uh, propeller put back on. Get the air hub on there. The propeller, the spinner back plate. And then the spinner cap, of course. There we go. Done deal. Alright, let's put this uh, side cover on, and then uh, that's about it. We'll shut these covers down. Alright, bottom covers going on. And then I think that's about it. Shut this baby down here. And that should be it, I think. As far as I know. She spins over. The real way to tell is if we can sign off on the work order. Which we can. Hell yes. Let's end this. There's my scrib. spare parts that's right we did it oh yeah so cool we got everything on this one perfect job we got a pretty good ranking up on that one not bad at all uh, we'll go ahead and uh, skip to the next scene here but man I hope you guys enjoyed that uh, let me know in the comments I kind of got stuck for a second but I was able to get through it there so I just had to uh, put the damn heads back on it but that's it uh, so 
in the next episode, we will be taking a look at these Tiger Moth again. Hopefully we change planes soon. I don't know how long. We have to keep working on the same plane, so I don't know. I'm with you guys on that one, so I'll let you know. But uh, till the next time of Plane Mechanic Simulator, guys, hit that subscribe. Let me know in the comments what you thought of that episode, and uh, we'll see you next time. Peace out.